Eating the right superfoods can help you in more ways than one. In fact, we have a dietitian, Alexandra Miller from Metafast, who's joining us this morning. And you brought what we're supposed to put in our shopping carts. Yes. However, we're supposed to stop here and not get the other things, you know, the other sweet, the donuts and everything else. But thank you for bringing this display. So tell me exactly why these are such superfoods. Well, these are our all heart healthy foods to okay. celebrate American Heart Month. All right. I brought foods that, whether it's helping to improve your blood cholesterol or lower blood pressure, it's just heart healthy foods. So okay. that's what we're here to talk about today. Okay, and so uh, obviously we have the oil here. Normally when you think oils, you think fats and oils, and that would be ties in with cholesterol, right? But that's, right. Not, that's not the case. Well, we have olive oil here, and actually it's extra virgin olive oil. Okay. Usually considered the finest because it comes from the first pressing of the olives. So it has more antioxidants than any of the other olive okay. oils, and it's a rich source of monounsaturated fats, which are heart healthy, have been shown to help reduce the risk of heart disease. Does that make you feel fuller too when you eat? Well, I mean, I think that would be a matter of opinion, but sure. Okay. It has I, a little I, bit of... I'm not, I don't know. I'm just throwing it out there because I'm like, you Certainly. know, you got to have some fats in it, right? Yeah, and you do. You do. You, okay. All fats right, are good. very important, so... Okay. One of my favorites. This is the one that we always have in our house. Uh, salmon. salmon. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. So there's two things I love about salmon. First, right. it's an excellent source of omega-3 fatty acids, okay. which are great for your heart. And second, it's a great source of protein, which keeps you full and satisfied throughout the day. Okay. And that can help you manage your weight if you're getting lots of protein and, and being at a healthy weight is great for your heart as well. Okay, but so, what if you eat it every day? I mean, is there a limit to how much salmon intake you should have? Well, moderation is key, but actually the American Heart Association recommends mm -hmm. having it at least twice a week, a fish like salmon. Okay, all right, so, well, some tilapia or something else. Yeah, in absolutely, there. Okay. absolutely. And then, of course, we can supplement or uh, the Metafast products. Oh, yeah, Metafast. so we have the Metafast oatmeal. Oatmeal is a rich source of soluble fiber, which has been shown to help manage cholesterol, lower blood pressure. Okay. And what I love about the Metafast oatmeal is for about 100 calories, Calories, not only are you getting that fiber, right. but you're getting 11 grams of soy protein. And soy protein is a source of protein that is low in fat and cholesterol free. So another heart healthy option. Another great way. Okay. Yeah. And then of course we move to the greens. I mean, almost yes. everybody knows greens <laughs> are the key. You need to get it. But avocado, another thing high in fat and fills you up. But right. But unsaturated fat so it's a so heart it's healthy fat and like you said you need a little bit right. avocado has a nice rich buttery taste so it can be used in a lot of different ways whether it's on a sandwich spread or topped on a salad my favorite is to use it as a butter substitute so you can replace half of the butter in your recipe with mashed avocado when you're baking it would look I, weird but okay mix well it here's in the thing there. it won't turn green so you'll be good there right, that's you won't good. have a right, green cookie <laughs> speaking of green though we have uh and i came over here and i said what is this what type of lettuce but uh tell me about it. it's kale it's beef Maybe kale. Absolutely. So kale is probably one of the most healthy vegetables out there. Okay. One cup will get you over 100% of your vitamins A, C, and K for the day. Okay. You've got fiber. I could go on and on. But right. kale's great. Kale's and you great. were saying earlier that you like to make kale chips. Yeah, kale chips. Put them in the oven, sprinkle a little bit of sea salt on them, and you've got yourself your, your own regular Nice, heart-healthy yeah. snack. Absolutely. Right. Alexander, we need to go right now, but of course, a dark chocolate organic is always the key to oh, yeah. fulfill the sweet tooth. Yeah. Thank you so much. I may actually partake in that one right there <laughs> when we leave here, but thank you very Sounds much for coming good. in. Sounds good. Thanks, Tom. Alexander Miller with MetaFast right here. Well, of course, if you missed any of that part right here, we've got that right now on our website.